the FAA loves to just dilute things and make things super complicated. At its core, the wind triangle is what you see before you. It is basically <clears throat> your course of flying an aircraft accounted for wind. Think of it like crosswind adjustments. So if you're uh, flying along and you have a wind from the, the left-hand side, you're going to have to kind of turn into the wind in order to maintain the same course or the same track. And the the whiz wheel, the E6B back on the, the back side, the wind calculation side, will go over all, all of that. How to calculate what your true heading will be or what your, you know, heading from point A to point B without any wind would be like 090. But with, you know, 10 knots of wind from this direction, it's actually going to be minus three degrees or plus four degrees or whatever it happens to be to find that wind correction angle to get you basically to be able to track true to your destination or to your point. At its core, the wind triangle is uh, your track accounted for any crosswinds or uh, any sidewinds or, or anything that kind of pushes you off course. We'll jump right into uh, using on the next uh, lessons, the E6B calculators to talk through some of this uh, calculations and how it all, all evolves or plays out. Be sure to like and subscribe for more information. If you're serious about helicopters and you don't know where to start, I'd love to help you out. I have a free course that's perfect for you. Click the link below to check it out.